Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is super exciting because my cousin Manera is coming from Florida. If you recall what happened last summer, her mom got really sick, so she had to go back home. So I'm really excited. Um, but right now I am going to make a dish in the crock pot so it's ready for us tonight. Um, I just got over a really bad cold, so we haven't really been vlogging, but I'm hoping to make up uh, for that this week. So anyway. Anyway, um, why don't you guys come and join me? I'm gonna make like um, like a beef barbacoa, like thing for tacos, um, using a slow cooker. So, yeah, why don't we get started? So first, I have some beef stew pieces here. Um, I'm just gonna add some salt and pepper onto this, and then what I'm gonna do is. Um, kind of pan sear it. Um, doesn't have to be fully cooked through it, but we want um, it to get dark and caramelized. And then we'll go on to the next step. So first, we'll salt and pepper these. Okay, once everything has been mixed up together, and I know that was a lot of salt, but there's a lot of meat on here, we're gonna bring it over here um, to my pan, which I previously heated, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna sear our beef. Now, this is probably easier with a bigger chunk of beef, but these packets were on sale. Um, and it saved me a trip to go to our personalized butcher, so. So essentially you want to clean your meat and you don't want to overcrowd the plant either, so just be careful with that. Now I have some beef here. Um, that's been seared and I just took out a separate pan to keep searing the rest. So while that sears, we're going to go ahead and make our marinade. Um, the first thing we're going to throw in here is chipotle peppers in adobo sauce. So those are the chipotle peppers. And then we're going to throw in about five um, cloves of garlic. You can chop these up if you want, but because they're going in the slow cooker, I see no need, so I'm going to throw those in. You're also going to throw in a tablespoon of cumin. I could probably do a little bit more, actually. That should be good. We're going to do about three teaspoons of oregano. We're going to do some salt. And we're also going to do some black pepper. Now you also want to put in some beef broth. Unfortunately, I don't have any. So I'm just going to put some hot water in here. About half a cup. That should be good. Then we want to put about a dash or two of vinegar. And then lastly, you want to take some lime wedges and squeeze that in. I'm going to do a whole lime. Okay, so I've just mixed together my marinade. Um, this is really like, it smells amazing. It's so nice and thick. And oh, it smells so good. That probably wasn't a good word to use. But anyway, so what we're going to do is we're going to take some of this mixture and we're going to pour in just a little bit to the bottom of the pan. Throw in some peppers there. Okay. And then, just grabbing my spoon, I'm just gonna take the liquid and spread that around. Perfect. Okay. Once that's done, you're gonna grab your beef. So once you've thrown in your beef, we can add in the rest of 
the liquid here. And then you want to give everything a really good mix. Right, so our meat is in here. We're all ready to go with our bay leaves added in. I added three or four. And then I'm going to put this on um, low heat here. Oops, there we go. For eight hours. When we come back at around 8.30 p.m., this will be amazing. Hey, guys. Welcome back to the vlog. It's vlog number... 23. 22. 22. And we are just on the way to pick up my cousin. She's here from Florida. If you tuned into my vlog in the summer, it was really sad because she couldn't come and she was here and then she had to go back. So um, she's just arrived. We're almost there. Ershan and I are getting over this really bad cold. <clears throat> we're gonna get her sick. Hopefully not. Yeah, anyway, we're gonna head out. Um, I will film in a little bit. Bye. Bye. Although it's not it's that not cold that today. Yeah, it's not too bad. How's your flight? It was good. It was good. We're gonna have so much fun. And you're gonna have fun with us too, right? Yeah, I'm so excited. Yeah. yeah. The trio is back. The trio is back. So we're at our first stop. And we got Juicy Lucy's at Burger Factory. If you've never had a Juicy Lucy before, it's filled in the middle with cheese and jalapenos. Yeah. Hey guys, so we just got home from doing our nails and everything and my beef has been cooking for about, I don't know, since about 12.30 and now it's 8.30, so about eight hours. Um, I'm gonna give you a look at it and then, yeah. Okay, so this is what the beef looks like. As you can tell, I've already shredded it with two forks. Um, there's some liquid at the bottom there in the juice it is so delicious i gave it a shot it's so good like i i can't explain how good it is um and the best part all oh, the fog is coming up from the heat here but the best part is how easy it was to pull um apart the beef and actually i didn't even start with two forks i was just moving my spoon around like this and it was just doing its thing um, <clears throat> so anyway, here is the beef. We're going to be making some tacos with this. For now, I'm just going to put the lid back on until we're ready to have it. But it looks so freaking good. Yes. No, this is real. What a trade. I got you Christmas. Thank you. I got you. I don't know what this is, but I felt like it resembled like a Chanel bag. Oh, that's so cute. Okay, so for dinner today, we have the barbacoa beef. We have pico de gallo. I made them all. No. <laughs> cheese, avocados, and then <clears throat> tortilla, which I won't bother trying. <laughs> I well, hope you guys enjoyed checking out how I made that beef barbacoa today. It's not really beef barbacoa because beef barbacoa is made from a cow's face. Um, like from what I understand, it's like a cow's head basically, like it's cheeks and stuff. Um, and I wasn't about to use that so I went out and I got stew instead. But anyway, besides all that fun stuff, I have something even more fun today. And that is all the shopping that my awesome cousin did for me um, in Florida before she came. So I know I'm in my pajamas, but I have to share with you guys because I'm so excited about some of the stuff that I got. So without further ado, let's do a little haul. Let's do a little haul. 
Okay, so these are all of the things um, that I purchased that she bought for me. So first, let's start with the stuff over here. So I grabbed two of the Lily Galici lashes in Miami. I'm truly, really excited about these guys. Um, so anyway, yeah, we got two of these. And my lashes are gonna look amazing. And then I got two Morphe sponges. Um, one of them is a flawless beauty sponge, and that's the shape that it's in. And then the other one is the highlight and contour sponge, um, which kind of resembles like a typical regular beauty blender. Um, but really excited about both of these. I know that they come really highly recommended from Jaclyn Hill, so I'm excited to see what those look like. And then you've probably seen me use these in a couple of my videos. This is the Morphe um, setting spray or setting mist. Uh, I ran out and I needed another one of these because it smells amazing and does a really good chop setting, so I had to get my hands on another one of these. And then I got the Morphe 350 palette. Let me open it up and show you guys what it looks like inside. All right, so here is the Morphe 350 palette. It is absolutely gorgeous. It's filled with lots of warms, lots of neutrals, colors that I can use all the time. Um, so I'm really, really excited about this one. Like, just everything about this is gorgeous so pretty and then of course i got the jaclyn hill palette i am so freaking excited about this one so i wanted to leave this last for you guys let's open it up Irshad is watching some sort of like vine so if you hear random yelling and stuff that's what's happening over there plus basketball happening behind us. Okay, that was a struggle So here is the Jaclyn Hill palette um, I'm just so excited about this. I can't even I've already swatched a couple of the colors and they are gorgeous So beautiful Woo! So anyway, these were some of the stuff that I received um, from Florida and my cousin brought it down for me so I'm like really excited to start using everything. Yes! So this morning we made an omelet filled with some cheese and some beef from last night. Looks pretty good. Looks pretty good, huh buddy? Our house looks Hey guys, so we just had a really good day today. We had massages and we just hung out. And now we're on our way to go to a restaurant called Restaurant Malaysia. Are you excited, sister? I'm so excited. She's more excited for the snow right now though. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, today is Friday and Munir is here for a couple more days. Um, so tonight we're going to my friend Pooja's house and then um, before we go she really wanted to have some hello pepperoni pizza so let me show you guys how good this looks hold on here we go okay oh yeah do you see that pepperoni oh this looks amazing yum she is just finishing up and then uh, and then we're gonna eat and head out soon. Hello. Oh my god, my ear, man. Oh, oh my gosh. See hi. Oh my gosh. We're four eye freaks. We're eight eyes. I need pizzas here. Yeah, red red I'm like standing right beside the cake. No, it's, <laughs> uh, it's supposed to be really good. I heard La Rocca cakes are really good. Yeah, they are. Mm -hmm. What what is La Rocca? It's a brand of cakes. I know their white chocolate raspberry cake is like amazing. So I went to the cheesecake factory. Cheesecakes like like Oreo cheesecake, and it's too much Oreo. Like I don't like the middle filling in the Oreo. Yeah. Say hi. Say hi. Wait, everyone's wearing pajamas. Say hi. Hello. I know. I was like, uh. Oh. Same to say. Thunder. Feel the thunder. 
Lightning in the Honda, Honda, Honda. That song always plays at the gym. <laughs> it's such an annoying song. <laughs> what, is, what is he singing about though? Like I just only know that lightning and thunder part. I honestly Honda. <laughs> and I can drive a nineteen twenty station. Oh my god. Okay, that's good. That was yeah. amazing. Probably felt like an idiot. Yeah, like you should. Someone Who someone was looking at your out. Snapchat and all being judged. Our neighborhood cry out. He just stands outside and protests. Why is like, devil in control of the world? Hey. What you do? Wow. Is it weird? What that you is doing? embarrassing. I'll oh take a picture of him next time. Like, like you don't. Oh and the spelling and grammar is so bad. But like the, the funniest part of Americans is like they really, truly, truly believe that one. Are you sure this is right? Yeah, this is it. I don't know all the words, but that's like seventy percent of the words. What about when they say? It's the very end. That's the grand finale. Cool. Hey guys, so it is Saturday morning, lots of snow, we're on our way to Toronto, Irshad's going to play basketball, and me and Manir are going to go shopping and cutting her hair. Say hi Munni! She just had a little photo shoot in the snow. <laughs> what are you up to, Just driving. I'll show you guys how snowy it really is. So we're being mad refs right now and eating kotroti in the car. Mm. Even though we're having hakka in a few hours. Where's that, where's that plate? <laughs> I'm just gonna use, put some on. <laughs> oh, it's still there. Hey guys, so we're just at Philly's right now. <laughs> Say hello, everyone. <laughs> Hi. What are you guys excited for? The you food. wanted to come here? So yeah, say. Yeah, that's why right. we're just waiting for the food. Please, food, come. I'm so excited. I love this place, you know. You said you're happy now? Very really happy. Two thumbs up. <coughs> Two thumbs up. Happy. <laughs> Monira? Five thumbs up. She has five thumbs, you know? Rithi Krashen's wife. <laughs> so guys, today I went to Adonis and look at how many haritos I bought. I bought freaking 11. 11! But this flavor is so good. This is the mandarin flavor and then the rest are pineapple. So I'm gonna store them in my little containers now and then we're gonna put them in the fridge. Different in the world. What? This is Isia and Hanisa. He's so crazy. He's so crazy. Good morning. What day is it today? Sunday. It's the 24th. And we. It's not the 24th. It's called Christmas Eve. T tonight is Christmas Eve, psychopath. 24th is Christmas Eve. Hello. Good morning, Christmas Eve. <laughs> So anyway, today is Christmas Eve, and uh, we are going out to have some Mexican food right now. What is that on my eye? Is that an eyelash? That would be really embarrassing. I think it is. Anyway, so we are like going out. We're gonna have some Mexican food. Ersha's gonna be at home. He doesn't want to come with us. Then we're gonna go to Jada. But you said, babe, stay home! <laughs> I hate you when you come out! I said, oh. Oh. So then? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is how much haritos we've been having already. There's been four. Four bottles of When you go down, haritos. you take it to the recycle. Hey guys, it's me and Muni here. We just got out of a movie. And now it's snowing like crazy. I just cleaned the back of my car over there. And now there's snow again. 
and we watched Pitch Perfect 3, which I thought was good. Was what did you think? So funny. It was so, so funny. I feel like Pitch Perfect 1, 2, and 3 have all been really good. I don't know what my fourth finger is up like. There's a fourth, but there's three. So anyway, now we're on our way home in the snow. Thankfully, we live only 10 minutes away. This is snow, by the way, guys. It's not stains. Um, but yeah, thankfully, we live really close, so... Yeah, hopefully we go home safely. Bye. See you later. See you later. <coughs> we found someone. It's Santa. He waved at us before, but oh, he's putting on his hat. Oh, he's so sweet. Merry Christmas. See you later. <laughs> <laughs> and the other big huge ones. Joy set time. Someone is leaving. Yep. <sighs> Why? Alright. See you in the downstairs world. <sighs> Say bye bye. See you later. You don't want your phone? Oh, yeah. That would be nice. <laughs> I'll miss you, sister. I'll miss you too. I'm trying to focus on you. I'll miss you. We'll see each other again. Will you miss us too, Nietzsche? Yeah, I'm gonna miss you. You can just come over, okay? You can get day years, no problem. I can get you a job in Canada. Yeah. <laughs> this is our conversation every time that we'll get her a job in Canada. Yeah. Maybe one day. Actually, I think the snow kind of scared you. I don't think I can make it. Yeah. It's tough. This is Sure. To put on the emergency lights, no? So we just dropped off Manera. <sighs> so sad. Say sad. So sad. So sad. Getting off. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Yesterday, um, we dropped off Manira at her cousin's house. You guys are probably confused when I say that because I guess we would all be cousins, but I'm her cousin on her dad's side, and um, the cousin that, whose house she went to yesterday is her cousin on her mom's side. So um, we split the time with her every time Manira comes down to Toronto, and uh, right now she's gonna be spending a week with her. Um, so yeah, kinda sad because I miss her a lot. But uh, went back to work today and that kind of kept me busy. So I guess it's a good thing in a way. Hey guys, thanks so much for tuning in to this week's video. I know it's a little bit choppy and I do apologize. Just sometimes when you're spending time with family, it's a little hard to film like introductions and like you know, end the day and all that sort of stuff. But hope you guys enjoyed spending some time with me. If you haven't watched my latest video before this one, make sure you click right here uh, to watch the latest video there. And then if you haven't subscribed to my channel, which I would love for you guys to do because I think we're at like 1,043 or something like that, which is really awesome. Um, and obviously we wanna keep growing. So make sure you click below right here on that little icon with my picture and subscribe to my channel. So anyway thank you guys so much for tuning in thank you so much for watching and i will see you guys in the next video Mwah.